In this video, we will be teaching you how to set up an account on Wokfi Simulator. We will also teach you how to create a simple circuit and simulate it based on ESP32. Let's go to Google and search for Wokfi. Click on the first search result. This is the home screen of Wokfi. Here you can see multiple example circuits you can refer to. Before creating our first circuit, we have to create an account on Wakfi. For that, we will click on the sign up button on the top right corner. If you like, you can sign up with Google. Enter your email address and click next. Then enter your password. Now you are logged into Wakfi with your Google account. Or else you can sign up with your email. Enter your email address. Now you will receive an email to your email address for verification. After you verify, you are logged in. Let's go back to the Wokfi home. Now to create our first circuit, I will scroll down up to the starts from scratch section. There you can see the boards that you can use in Wokfi Simulator. You can also look for more options. I will create a circuit with ESP32. Now let's get familiarized with the Wokfi interface. You can click on any component and drag it around to move it. To add another component, you can click on the plus button and select the component that you need and place it where you want. You can press R on your keyboard to rotate it. You can also change the LED's color using the color bar on the front. You can flip it by clicking the flip button or pressing P on your keyboard. Now I will add a resistor. Unfortunately, the Wokfi does not provide the functionality to change the resistance of the resistor on their platform. I can right click anywhere on the surface and move it. I can use the scroll button to zoom in or zoom out. To connect the components together, I can press on the two ends of the wire to create a wire between them. I can change the color of a wire by clicking on it and choosing my color. Now in the editor, I will write my code. I'm writing this code to blink the LED. Now I will click save to save my simulation. I can also share my simulation with others by clicking on the share button and copying the link. I can rename my sketch as well. Wokfi provides more options to save a copy or to download the project as a zip file as well. Now I will click the run button on the simulation window to start my simulation. Now the LED is successfully blinking. I can either pause or stop the simulation as a whole. 